I'm a strong-willed and determined person with a lot of perseverance. That's me. I'm Elitsa Yankova and I'm a Bulgarian wrestler. 22-year-old freestyle wrestler Elitsa Yankova took up her sport when she was 15. Her father, Atanas, was a Greco-Roman wrestler. Elitsa proved a natural at the sport and the Bulgarian dominated the junior wrestling scene in her homeland. The first big medal that I won was a silver at the European Girls' Championships. The following year I managed to win gold at the Junior World Championships and that was amazing. Having done well amongst the juniors, I then made the move up to the seniors. However, two years ago Elitsa almost walked away from the sport after seriously injuring her spine. Yet, following an operation and three months of recovery, she returned to the mat at the 2015 European Games in Baku, Azerbaijan. Despite not being in her best form at the Games, Yankova clinched a silver medal in the 48 kilogram division, which is the lightest weight category in women's freestyle wrestling. Elitsa's coach is Petr Kasabov. At one stage, because of the injury, we didn't know if Elitsa would continue with her sporting career. So when she finished second at the European Games in Baku, I was really pleased and proud of her. But for me, the greatest moment and the happiest memory came at the last Olympic Games in Rio, where she managed to win a bronze medal. When we caught up with Elitsa, she was training in Samokov, a town close to the popular ski resort Borovets in the southwest of Bulgaria. Elitsa trains alongside her close friend and fellow freestyle wrestler Evelina Nikolova. I have always admired Elitsa's strong mentality. She's very driven. She's faced some challenges over the years, but nevertheless, she has pulled herself together when it mattered, and she made it to the Olympics. And not just that, she managed to win a medal, which was always her goal. I saw how hard she worked and trained, and how much effort she put into it all. She wanted it so much, and she did so well. Elitsa spends the majority of the year living at training camps. The 22-year-old hails from Varna, a city on the Bulgarian Black Sea coast. She looks forward to going back there when she can to see her boyfriend Mehmed, who's also a wrestler. During the off-season, I go back to my hometown. That's when I see my boyfriend. What we love most is being outside. We go for long walks together, and we just simply enjoy spending time together. Away from wrestling, another big passion in Elitsa's life is traditional Bulgarian folk dancing. Ranging from repetitive moves to more complex choreographies, this style of dancing is typically performed as a line dance. I got into folk dancing when I started going to school. I even went to a class to study it. I danced until I joined the national wrestling team. I would say that I almost did it professionally. I even competed in dancing contests. Nowadays, it's something that I only really do in my spare time, usually when I'm back in my hometown. Since the Rio Olympics, Elitsa's training schedule has been relentless. However, after having suffered a few injuries in the past, she knows when to train hard and when to train lightly. The 2017 Freestyle Wrestling World Championships take place in France in August. 
I'm taking everything year by year. In this sport, injuries can be bad and keep you off the mat for a long time, so preparation is crucial. I'm aiming for gold at the World Championships, then we'll start preparing for the Tokyo Olympics. I don't really like talking about the future. I want Elitsa to take things one day at a time. Together, we'll work hard and continue to improve. We'll do the best we can to achieve our goals. Our big dream is gold at Tokyo 2020.